Spirit 1053, you're with Erica and Steve. Hey, Eric and Steve, it's Pat Barrett. Let's go. Hey, hey Pat. <laughs> <laughs> you're coming to town. Oh, my gosh. We're on, I mean, we're basically on our way. Like, not basically. We woke up in um, Bend, Oregon. So I'm about to take my three kids. We're, we're going out to find some snow. They are just so excited. Okay, how cool is that? So, I mean, the best. It's the best. Pat, you've been to Washington, right? I have, yeah. I've been to Seattle. I haven't had, like... Tons of time to explore outside, like, the cities, which is why you live in Seattle. Like, the city's amazing, but, <laughs> <laughs> like, the outdoors are unbelievable. We have friends that live out there, so we're so excited. Oh, we're so glad. And you know we have the best coffee in the world. What's your favorite kind of coffee? Seattle's best. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Good answer, Pat. <laughs> well, you, you know what's funny? I'm not, like, I just kind of take what's there, but I just love black coffee. You just drink it black. Get an Americano. Yes. You give me you give me a good cup of black coffee and you're my friend for life. Pat, maybe you could uh, settle a little debate that Steve and I have been having on the show this week. What are your feelings on pumpkin spice? Okay. Well, I <laughs> want to tell you this. I have a very personal story that happened this week. Because <laughs> we got an order of coffee for all the guys. And then <laughs> my guitar player, Benjamin, like kind of like the biggest looking macho guy, got his <laughs> order. And he took a sip and he like closed his eyes. Like it was like a Snickers commercial or something he was so i was like i was like bro what is that and he didn't tell me so i took a sip and i was like that is unbelievable what is this and it was the, it was the mighty pumpkin spice so i'm in i don't think there's really a debate mm. once you try it you can't you're just like well that is delicious i see thank you pat <laughs> <laughs> you gotta be honest <laughs> Steve is speechless. <laughs> yeah, so am I. I was the most shocked. <laughs> I was at, I was like, I can't believe this is where I'm at. I, this is, I'm Team Pumpkin. <laughs> <laughs> You've been touring with your kids, is that right? Yeah, so the first weekend, the first run of dates, I just kind of went out to get everything settled in. But then I flew home and picked them up, and we just had, it's been like Barrett party time. And my wife is at home just doing her thing she gets uh, that i mean the role reversal on this tour is absolutely unbelievable because usually when i tour it's you know she's holding down the home front wow and now she gets like a lot of time to just do whatever which has been amazing i love this role reversal on instagram you called it beautiful chaos can you elaborate on that a little bit oh i mean of course but <laughs> you know <laughs> Like when you travel with, like traveling with kids, my wife and I would always say this, when you go on vacation, especially when you have small kids, like it's not really a vacation. No. It's your normal life in, you know, a spot of your choosing without everything that makes it convenient. So <laughs> that's literally what is kind of happening. Like the kids each have their bunk. We bought, like they picked out their sheets. So my, my youngest, my four-year-old Cash has like the baby Yoda sheets. <laughs> yes! <laughs> Crew has the Avengers, my, my seven-year-old, my daughter has Lilo and Stitch sheets, oh. and I mean, every night. We're doing virtual school as well while they're out on the road, which has been really crazy, but really amazing because they get to, like, we were driving through Utah, and my son was doing this reading program, and it was talking about Utah while we were driving through it. No way. Which is just cool. Like, we have, like, little moments like that that have been like, oh, this is like, how else would this happen? That's pretty neat. It really Yes, good for you, Pat. You get a lot of credit for this. I love it. Well, we're having a blast. We really, we really are. And the nights have been so fun. Yeah. The kids have been loving it. And it's been a long time. We haven't been able to do this in a year and a half. Wow. Well, we can't wait. We're going to be there on Sunday night, Pat. What does a worship night with you look like? Paint the picture for us. Paint the picture. Oh, I love that. I, well... <laughs> That night will be really special because that'll be the last night of the tour for this run of dates. And oh. I'm, I can't even believe I'm saying that. It makes me a little sad because it's just been so, every night has been so, so special. And one thing that I've felt just from the beginning of the first note of every night is just how, on my side, I think, how grateful I am to be able to, to connect with people again in a way that I thought I wouldn't be able to, you know, or didn't know when the next time I'd be able to, rather. Yeah. And you can just tell in a room with people where some of the, uh, the communal aspect of worship hasn't 
it hasn't been there as prominently for a long time. Like the feeling in the room is just a, a sense of like, thank you, God. Last year has been hard and we're highly aware of how much we need each other, how much we need you. And when you have those two things present in worship, it just feels, uh, it almost feels miraculous. Wow. Because it's not just singing songs. It's entering into just a, uh, a place of a grateful heart, just thanking God for things we may have overlooked or taken for granted mm. over the wow. last two years. So really special. I'm excited to sing all these songs. I got new songs I'm singing every night that I've this tour is in the first time actually leading them, which has been great. And <laughs> of course, the leading songs like Build My Life and The Way and so happy to sing those songs again with people. We can't wait. You can't spell party without Pat Barrett. Thank you so oh much. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking that. <laughs> you can't spell party without Pat. <laughs> <laughs> we can't wait to see you Sunday night. God bless you and thank you for your valuable time. Love it. Thank you all so much.